What's up guys, Jason here from BuiltByYoga.com and this is Yoga for Snowboarding. So the thing about snowboarding is it demands a lot of strength and a lot of stability, especially in the legs. The purpose of this video is to give you a practice that's going to condition your body to head out on the slopes. However you want to get there, we're going to start out in a child's pose. Really press into the hands, push through the shoulders, bring those hips down towards the heels. Make this active. Just hang out here for a moment. So bring your left hand over and bring your right hand on top of your left. Keep engaged through the shoulders, pressing through the hands. Feel that stretch in the side body. Bring your hands back to center and over to the right. Stay active in the shoulders, press through the hands. Feel a stretch deep in the side body. Just hold it here. Just take a deep inhale. Come back to center. We'll move up into a tabletop position. Take an inhale, bring your gaze up, arch the back. Exhale, press through, round the spine. Inhale, gaze goes up. Exhale, round the spine. Inhale, gaze goes up. Exhale, round the spine. Inhale up, exhale round. Come back to a neutral spine, bring your hands forward a bit, step up into a high plank. Really engage the core, hollow the body, tuck the tailbone, really strong through the legs, push into the hands. Just gonna hold it for a bit. Keep holding. Almost there. And exhale, move into a downward facing dog. Warm up the legs a bit. And swing your right leg up. And do big hip circles. Two more. Last one. Now reach that leg straight up and drive the knee towards the chest. Extend that leg out to the side, and we'll rotate into a fallen triangle. Really push into your right arm, reach your left arm overhead, activate those legs strong into the side body. We'll just hold it here. And return back to center, reach the leg up, bring it down in downward facing dog. Now bring your left leg up and work into some big hip circles. Last two, last one. Bring your left leg straight up. Press it through to the chest. Rotate over, fall in triangle on the other side. Again, press into that left arm. Reach that right arm overhead. Engage your obliques as you push them up towards the ceiling. Strong in the legs. Back to center. Bring that left leg up into your down dog. Bring your gaze towards your hands, lift your heels, and float to the top of your mat. Halfway lift, standing forward fold. Bring yourself up to a mountain pose. Hands come down to the side. Mountain pose with a slight back bend. Forward fold. Halfway lift, jump back into chaturanga. Upward facing dog, downward facing dog. A few more of these. Bring your gaze forward, float to the top of your mat. Halfway lift, forward fold. Bring your hands up into a mountain pose. Back down. 
and a mountain with a slight back bend, fold forward, halfway lift, jump back into Chaturanga. Inhale, upward face, exhale, downward face. Gaze forward, float to the top of your mat, halfway lift, fold forward. Bring your arms up into a mountain pose. Bring the hands down to the side. Up into a mountain, slight back bend, fold forward. Halfway lift, float into your chaturanga. Upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Now bring your left leg up. Bring your knee to your nose for one. Bring it back. Knee to nose, two, bring it back. Knee to nose, three, and back. Knee to nose, four, back. Last one, you're gonna bring the leg all the way through. Inhale, crescent lunge. Exhale, airplane pose. Bring that leg through, kick it forward if you can. Exhale. Bring it back to your airplane pose. Down to crescent lunge with control. Bring the arms up. Push through airplane pose. Press that leg through. And bring it back to airplane pose. With control, slowly lower that leg. Come into your crescent lunge. Press through into an airplane. Bring that right leg through. Extend it and bring it back. Airplane pose. Slowly with control. Back down to the mat. Up into your crescent lunge. Push it through. Airplane pose. Kick that right leg through all the way back slowly with control bring that foot down and meet the mat crest lunge last one push it up into your airplane pose kick that leg through bring it back it's okay if you fumble regain control airplane pose bring that foot down to the mat Crescent lunge, frame the hands around the foot. Walk that left foot towards the left hand, drop the right heel, and bring your right hand up, extended side angle. Bring your elbow up to your inner quad, and then if you can, lift your left arm straight up. Activate the leg muscles, really reach through the arms. Just hold it here. Bring your left elbow down to meet the quad. Bring the left hand all the way down. Swing the right hand over. And we're just gonna sink into a lizard lunge here. Just breathe it out. If you have the flexibility and you want a little more, come up to your hands. and then push on your left inner quad, opening up that hip, flex that foot. Bring your right foot up, peel open and grab it with your left hand. If you need even more, you can come down to your forearm and then just open up, bring that chest toward the ceiling. Hang out here for a moment. We'll let go, come back to your lizard lunge. Take a moment here. Come back onto the hands. Bring your leg back into a high plank. Down to your chaturanga. Upward facing dog, downward facing dog. Lift your right leg, 
Bring your knee to your nose for one. Bring it back. Knee to nose, two. Bring it back. Knee to nose, three. And back. Knee to nose, four. Bring it back, fifth one. We're going all the way through, stepping in between the hands. Come up into your crescent lunge. Float forward into an airplane. Kick that left leg through. Bring it all the way back. Airplane pose. Slowly bring that left foot down to meet the mat. Up into your crescent lunge. Push through. Airplane pose. Bring that foot through. And extend it all the way back. Airplane pose. Get in control. Bring that foot down to meet the mat. Up in your crescent lunge. Push through. Airplane. Bring your foot through. And bring it back. Airplane pose. Slowly with control. Bring that foot down. Meet the mat. Up into your crescent lunge. Press it through. Airplane pose. Extend that leg forward. Bring it back. Airplane pose. Slowly meet the mat with your foot. Up into crescent lunge. One more. Bring it forward. Airplane pose. Bring your foot through. Back. Airplane pose. It's okay if you're losing control. Just come back to it. Bring the foot down. Meet the mat. Come up. Crest lunge. Frame that foot. Inch it over to the right. Drop that left heel. Open up into your extended side angle. Bring your elbow up onto your inner thigh. And then if you can, bring it all the way up. Extend through the arms. Really activate into the legs. Just one last push. Hold it. Keep holding. Bring it down. Bring that hand all the way down. Come into your lizard lunge. Good job. Bring the forearms to the mat. Have a moment of breath here. Again, if you want more, you can come up or just from your forearm, you can press that right hip open. Bring that left foot to meet your right hand. And peel open, bring the chest up towards the ceiling. Hang out here for a moment. Feel a deep stretch into your quad. And let go. Come back to your lizard lunge. And take a moment of breath here. Come back into your hands. Bring that right foot back, high plank. Come down into your chaturanga. Upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Bring the gaze forward, lift the heels, float to the top of your mat. I'm gonna come into chair pose. And just hold it here. Bring your right leg back. Crescent lunge. Kick it forward. Chair pose. Bring your left leg back. Touch the mat, crescent lunge, bring it forward. Reset into chair pose. Kick the right leg back. Up in your crescent lunge, bring it forward. Reset, chair pose. Bring your left leg back. Crescent lunge, bring your leg forward. Chair pose, last one on both sides. Bring your right leg back. 
up into your crescent lunge. Bring the leg forward, chair pose. Last one, bring the left foot back. Crescent lunge, bring it forward, chair pose. A twist over to your right hand side. I'm just gonna hold it here. Back to chair pose. Twist over to your left. Just hold it here for a moment. Back to center, chair pose, and forward fold. Halfway lift, fold. Make your way up into a standing position and just breathe here. Bring the palms forward. Just regain your breath. Bring the hands up, mountain pose. Interlace the fingers and then lean over to the right side. Feel a deep stretch in your left side body. Come back to center. Stretch out and lean over to your left. Feel a deep stretch in your right side. If you wanna twist open a bit and bring the chest up, that's also an option. Turn to center. Come down onto the mat. All the way onto your back. Bring your heels just to touch your fingers. And lift the hips up. We're gonna go into some single leg hip raises. Bring your right leg up. Down for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Come all the way down. Press the hips up, bring your left leg up. Really plant your foot as you press through that hamstring. Really activate into the leg, pull that heel towards your butt. For five, four, three, two, last one. Good job, we'll move into a second round of these. Bring your right leg up, down, press it up, push through, activate that hamstring, drive that leg up, push, four, three, two, one, good, bring the left leg up, butt down, press up for one, and two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good job. Bring your back down to the mat, walk the heels out. Bring the knees in. You can windshield wipe the legs a bit. Rock them left and right. Bring the heels back. We're gonna move into a bridge. Press the hips up. Walk your shoulders under. Stay here. If you can get into full wheel, we'll bring the hands by the ears and press up in your full wheel. Really push through the legs. Try to straighten all the, your arms and your legs. Press into it. Just a few more seconds here. One final push. Then slowly, with control, bring your back down to meet the mat. Walk the feet out, windshield wipe your legs, whatever you need. Bring your knees into your chest. Bring your left leg straight. 
Squeeze the right knee into your chest. And then bring it over to your left. If you can reach for it, grab your foot. Extend that leg out. And then bend your right leg in. Grab it with your right hand. Twist open. Settle into this. Nice little twist to end the practice. Let go of the foot. Bend your right leg. Bring it back in the center. Pull it into your chest. Let it go. Bring the left knee in your chest. Pull it in with your arms. And then bring it slowly over to your right. Again, you can grab for that foot, extend that leg, bring your right leg back, grab it with your left hand, open up, final twist on this side, and let go of that foot, bend your leg, Bring it back into center. Squeeze it in your chest. Bring your right leg up. Go into a happy baby. Pull down on your feet. Try extending one leg. Extend the other. back into center. Let go of your feet, hug the knees in, bring your left foot down to the mat, right foot down to finish out your practice.